Hi guys, uh, welcome back to the channel. This is your uh, Tito Spidey once again. Today I'm going to teach you how to back up your SMS or your text messages. Um, because I noticed that uh, there are still people who use SMS or who keep their old phones because they have old messages there but they cannot throw away this old phone because their old SMS are still there so here's how you do it the name of the app is SMS backup and restore um, this is how you do it so you go to the Play Store you search SMS backup that's the only keyword and then you'll see a list of apps there uh, the the first one that shows up, aside from the ads, is SMS Backup and Restore. This is the app uh, made by Syntec PTY LTD. So you download it, install it. It will take some time to, to download it. But I'd like to tell you that I have been using this uh, SMS Backup and Restore app for about three years now. A friend of mine introduced me to this, um, Erwin of SwirlingOverCoffee.com. Uh, he told me that I can back up my old SMS and then, you know, transfer it or restore it to any phone that I use. So now, I've been using it for probably three years and in every phone that I use, I just restore the last uh, backup uh, SMS to the new phone. So example currently I'm using the Oppo a7 um, I've been using this for two weeks already and I'll be finished I'll be done with my review uh, today and I'll be transferring again to another phone this is the a or no, the f9 jade green let's open the SMS and backup and restore app so you'll be greeted with the, the welcome screen and just click get started and then it will ask for you to access your contacts of course you just uh, allow to allow it and then photos and medias allow okay and then allow to send and view SMS messages manage the phone calls allow also and then you're all set you'll be brought to the SMS uh, to the main screen and you can already set up a backup but uh, uh, the next thing that I, I'd recommend is to click the menu button here on the top left and then uh, click backup and then before you proceed with backing up you have to uh, click more backup locations and then you have to choose there are uh, several options here you can choose Google Drive, Dropbox, OneDrive, your phone or email so my recommendation is Google Drive because uh, you use Gmail to register or to activate or configure your phone. So Google Drive, just take it and then start the backup process. Just finished now. Um, the backup has been saved to my Google Drive. Now I'm transferring to my new phone already. This is the the A9, uh, the F9. Uh, what I'll do is just configure this, set this up uh, with my Gmail account and then download the same app, the SMS Backup and Restore app and then restore the backup SMS from this old phone. Uh, I'll show you again how to restore it. So here we go. I now have a new phone and I'll show you uh, the SMS. So there's no SMS. It's uh, blank. Now what we'll do is to download again, we go to Play Store and download uh, SMS Backup and Restore. So again, the, the app that you're going to download is SMS Backup and Restore by Syntec Pty Ltd. So let's install it. Let's wait for a while. fast so 
there we go the home the welcome screen and then the request for access to your media to your contacts etc um, and then we're now on the main screen by the way uh, while the restore is happening the app will uh, request to change the default SMS app into the this this one it's okay so let's proceed let's uh, tick restore and then the restore menu will ask you the location of the backup so again uh, we used Google Drive so point to Google Drive grant full access and then choose the account that you used it's the Gmail account that you used to to uh, log into this Android and then it will access your uh, Google Drive and then finally you will be brought to this screen um, uh, the, the, the the, the app has already found the backup which is February 26 right there um, and then the phone calls and then let's start the restore process there you go first it will download the, fi the file okay and then here's the screen that will uh, that will ask you to temporarily switch the default SMS app to uh, restore the messages just tick OK and then select change and then the restore process will start so let's just wait for a while again i have 1604 phone calls uh, in my history which is kind of nice because um, i will be able to check if somebody has called me previously i don't delete sms even if uh, those who are not in my contacts, the spammy SMS or uh, the scam SMS. I don't delete. I don't delete them. I just uh, store it there uh, for my future reference. By the way, if you are new to this channel, please do subscribe. And to my growing uh, supporters of Tech Patrol, uh, the 12,000 plus subscriber, thank you very much for your uh, support. Uh, because of that, I am very inspired. I am inspired to keep creating content for this channel okay so we are now about to finish 85 percent already in the restore progress yung uh, restore process dalawang part first it will restore your messages and then the last part is it will update the threads okay so it's okay now i have 17,398 messages so let's check this out click ok and then go to the home screen and click the 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 default sms app Okay, uh, it will now warn you to change the default messaging app to the original one. Just click change and then there you go. So there you go. Andiyan na yung mga, uh, mga old messages ko. Tingnan natin yung pinakaluma. Scroll down to the bottom. 2016. 2016 pa. So I have, yeah, 2016. Okay, so that's guys the, the app is SMS backup and restore by Syntec PTY Limited. So this will back up your phone calls and your SMS. Okay, so uh, to do it, you download the app from your from the Google Play, and then from the old phone, you back up it and you store it to your Google Drive, and into your new phone, you install it again and restore it. It will take you just a few minutes for, for uh, in my case, it took about uh, 10 minutes to restore 7,000 plus SMS. Okay, so that's it uh, for our uh, quick tutorial episode for today. I hope you learned something. And again, if you are new to this channel, please subscribe and click that bell button so that I can notify you if uh, I have new videos uh, that uh, I'm going to upload. And for the existing subscribers, thank you very much again. I appreciate your support. Um, again, this is your Tito Spidey, and see you in our next video. Peace.